Hey everybody. Here we have a computer fan that is in a very bad state of condition. Let's go ahead and see if we can apply some power to this thing and see what it does. It might be quite interesting. Because it is it is pretty well shot, if you ask me. Make sure I had this wired up right because this way this thing's designed is kind of weird. Come out of a different kind of computer than usual. See, I think I got that right. Let's see. Oh, yeah. You see it on the camera. There we go. Buddy, this thing moves some air when it's at full speed. Didn't know they moved as much air. But you can look at it as I shake it around. It's not sounding too good. Get you a little bit closer and you can see exactly what's going on with it. Now it's okay, but if I move it the slightest bit, it doesn't like it. Alright, it's going to power it off. Yeah, this thing is it's totally shot. Have a look at this, guys. You can see just how bad it wobbles. It still runs, but it makes a crap ton of noise. This came out of a... Um, this particular fan was formerly the um, ex rear exhaust fan from an HP Compact 6200 Pro workstation. Came out of a computer from work. Um, client had put in a um, help desk ticket about the machine making a crap ton of noise. This random noises. <laughs> and turns out this guy was the culprit. Switched out the fan and it's good as new, but I just had to show this to see you guys. I mean, this, yeah. I mean, it is totally shot. Now this now this isn't the worst um, case I've seen a fan in. Um, that goes to a 2012 video of a video card fan that had been exposed to a little bit of moisture, and the shaft had literally rusted out, and the um, the actual fan rotor would just fall right off the the motor. Let's give you an idea how cheap this thing is. It's one of those ones, and well, of course it's made in China. That's to be expected out of this kind of stuff. Um, they just had to put a little indention there to make it look like it's a serviceable fan, but it's actually not. Um, it's just um, hard plastic there, so you're kind of you're pretty much screwed at that point. Um, so there's no easy getting into this thing. Once it's once it's snapped together, there's no easy getting it off, but. Considering how broken this thing is, we may be able to get it off there. So we may have to give that a try. I'm thinking something, maybe the rear, maybe the rear sleeve bearing is shot. Well, these things generally have like one sleeve bearing, I think. I think the I think the sleeve bearing itself is just completely demolished. As this thing can just <laughs> shift around and do whatever it wants. Yep. 
be interesting if I could get that off of there. I think what I'm doing is going ahead and breaking this off. Aim the camera down so I can see what I'm doing a little bit better. This is a little bit better. Alright. See if I can feed her wires up from inside there. Well, the way I design this is going to be a little difficult, I think, but we'll see. Piece of garbage. Here we go. And that still kind of damaged the uh, wire insulation because it's so flipping thin. Yeah, they had to scamp in many, in many areas on this fan, didn't they? And usually I thought Foxconn made decent fans. At least with my prior experience with them, they did. This, not so sure about. Okay. Now you can get a better view of it. As you can see... Look how freaking wore out that is. Like it wants to pull off of there. It's so close. Oh, there goes the fan blades. <laughs> oh man, this thing is so freaking cheap. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'll probably break all the blades off her and get the thing, the rotor off the, get the thing off the motor. Yeah, so much for that. Yeah, that's that's really helping it. <laughs> that's really helping things. If I could just get that stupid thing off if we could see in there that'd be great, but I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. And I'm doing this off camera, but I live with it. <laughs> I can't get every single thing on video. Yeah. Totally, yeah, the, the, the blades are just <laughs> snapping right under the way of this whole thing. And I'm, I'm honestly, guys, I'm not putting much pressure on this thing either. It's just doing snap, crackle, pop with barely any effort at all. Well, guys, I don't think I'm going to get this off of here. And of course, our evil skid mark printer out there is looking straight at us. Yeah, I don't think it's going to happen. Good riddance. Anyways, guys, that was that was a Foxconn fan in a very sorry state of condition. <laughs> yeah, it was it was pretty freaking bad. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.